Chubby, the Friday the 13th Peacock prequel is one of the weirdest combos. A24, B-level slasher movies. What are your thoughts and expectations on this prequel and how it will perform? Seriously? I have no idea for the exact reasons that you said. I don't understand this combination. You just even look at some of the names that have been attached with it, um, with the showrunner. I think I saw today Kevin Williamson's might be attached with it. I don't get it. That is weird. I don't know what story they're telling. I don't know where there is to go with this. Like, is it taking the original Friday the 13th about Pamela Voorhees and the little details in there of everything that she was doing to avenge her son throughout the years? Is it just that stretched out so there's no Jason? Is it like a Zero Jason show? I just don't understand what they're going for and what attracted A24 to Friday the 13th. They feel like they're the, the opposite ends of horror. A24 is known for being elevated horror, artsy horror, art house horror, trippy weird ideas. I've said it many times before, Art uh, A24 isn't on my wavelength. And then they're sinking in with Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th started and they have fully admitted this as a Halloween knockoff. Multiple interviews, special features stated. The director went to the writer and said, go watch Halloween, figure out the code, and knock it off. That's what they set out to do. Even to the, the opening scene, and it, like just it in, was intended as a cheap knockoff of Halloween, and it took off. And it's a franchise that has never cared about continuity. You get to the second movie and it's like, Jason's actually alive! It makes no sense at all. That's why a lot of the casting, or a lot of the behind-the-scenes crew didn't return for the second one. They're like, Jason's dead. This isn't... What are you doing? And then he's a zombie when you get to the sixth one. He's in space eventually. What is A24 doing with this? What does A24 see that they're going to bring to an intentionally schlocky slasher franchise? That's why I like it, that they're goofy fun. It's very consumable, easy to digest, schlocky, slasher fun. A24 is known for the opposite of that. They, they, that's not the projects they're drawn towards. So I have no idea what to expect. I have no idea what A24 sees in it, wants to bring to it. I don't know, like, how, like, Kevin Williamson really being brought into this it is baffling to me. I don't understand any of it. I don't understand how you do a prequel to Friday the 13th, what that is. I don't understand this pairing. I don't understand why the talent's drawn to it. None of it. None of it makes any sense to me, which I guess makes it very interesting. Like, I'm very curious. Like, what will they produce from this very bizarre pairing of things? But I, I, I have no expectations.